Today, you'll learn how you can use ChatGPT to optimize your Google business profile with the help of prompt templates from Keywords Everywhere. So let's get started. Okay, so I wanna show you some really cool local SEO templates from Keywords Everywhere that you can use to optimize your Google business profile and other local listings that you may have for your business. So to get access to the templates, you need to go to keywordseverywhere.com and this is a browser add-on that you can install for Chrome and for Firefox. So have this installed. And the next step is to log in to your OpenAI account. Now in this ChatGPT dashboard, with the Keywords Everywhere extension installed and turned on, you'll notice two new things here. The first thing is this templates button on the left-hand side. And the second thing is this continue button on the top right-hand corner. So to get access to the local SEO prompt templates, you need to click on this templates button. And this will open up the Keywords Everywhere's ChatGPT prompt templates widget. We need to click the category dropdown and click on SEO. And for the subcategory, we're going to click on local SEO. And now these are all of the local SEO templates that we can use to optimize our Google business profile. So the first one I wanna show you is the optimize your Google business profile. Okay, so I'm gonna click on that. And you can see the widget expands to allow us to add additional information for this prompt template. We can choose from all of these different languages. We can also choose from these different voice tones as well. I'm gonna click on enthusiastic. We can also choose from all of these different writing styles. I'm gonna click on creative. And now we need to describe our business. So for this example, I'm gonna put down pet store with puppies, okay? So that's going to be our business. Then we need to provide it with how many categories we want it to suggest. So I'm gonna keep it as five categories and we can signify how many keywords we want it to suggest as well. You can specify the description length and we can tell it how many services we want it to suggest, okay? I'm gonna leave it as 10. And this is our completed prompt template. Now all of the information that we added up here automatically gets added to this prompt template. So as you can see here, it says you have an enthusiastic tone of voice, and that's what we selected up here. It also says you have a creative writing style, and we selected that up here, and the rest of the information is added here. Now you can edit the text in this prompt template if you wish, but this template has been created and tested to provide some really good information to help us optimize our Google business profile. So I'm not going to edit this template whatsoever. I'm just gonna click on execute template. Okay, so here we go. So it first provided us with some top categories, okay? And, and, and it organized it in this really nice table. It provided us with five category options, including the category ID. So you can review these and pick the category that best fits your business. It also provided us with some top keywords as well. So puppies for sale, pet store, dog food, pet supplies, and so on. And it also created a business description for us as well. It says, welcome to our pet store with puppies where we have everything you need to keep your furry friend happy and healthy, okay? And lastly, it provided us with a list of services that we can add to our Google business profile as well. So puppies for sale, dog grooming, pet supplies, pet adoption, and so forth. So within a few seconds, ChatGPT gave us all of this information that we can use to optimize our profile quickly and easily. Now let's go to the next template. I'm gonna click on this templates button and under the templates dropdown, I'm going to click on attributes for Google business profile. Now this template will tell ChatGPT to provide us with a list of attributes we can add to our profile, okay? so. Again, you can choose from all of these different languages, um, different voice tones, and also writing styles. And then we need to describe our business. So I'm gonna keep it as pet store with puppies. And lastly, we need to tell it how many attributes we want it to generate. I'm gonna leave it as five, and this is our prompt template, okay? Now I'm gonna click on execute template. Okay, so here we go. So it says, here are five attributes that I believe would be great to highlight in the Google business profile for your pet store with puppies, okay? So there's five listed here. The first one is puppy adoption service. This attribute is perfect for your business since you specialize in puppies. The second one is pet grooming, small dogs, pet supplies, and lastly, a knowledgeable staff. So you can add these as five attributes 
in your profile. So very helpful and very easy. Now let's go to the next local SEO template. So I'm gonna click on this templates button. And for the templates dropdown, I'm gonna click on generate Google business profile posts. Now I really like this template because it will help us generate posts for our Google business profile. So we don't need to manually do it ourselves. ChatGPT will create it for us and we can copy it and paste it on our Google business profile and publish it uh, maybe on a weekly basis to keep our profile updated and fresh. So you can choose from different languages again, different voice tones and also different writing styles. And I'm gonna keep the business the same, so pet store with puppies. And we can tell ChatGPT how many posts we want it to generate. I'm gonna leave it as three. And this is our completed prompt template. So I'm not going to change it. I'm gonna leave it as is and click on execute template. Okay, so it generated three posts for our pet store. This is the content for post number one. And what's really cool is that it also provided a call to action, okay? Now this one says, Visit our store today to find your new furry companion. And this one is the text for post number two with the call to action and the same for post number three. Now, all you need to do is review it, edit it, copy it and paste it and publish it on your Google business profile. This just makes updating your profile so much easier than before. Okay, so let's go to the next local SEO template. I'm gonna click on the templates button, click on the templates dropdown and I'm gonna click on generate Q&A for your Google business profile. Now this one will generate a Q&A for us. So again, you can choose from different languages, different voice tones, and also different writing styles. And we have our business right here, pet store with puppies, and we can signify how many Q&As we want. I'm gonna leave it as five. And this is our prompt template and I'm gonna click on execute template. Okay, so we have five Q&As. So we have the first question here, what types of puppies do you offer at your pet store? And we also have the answer to that question. It says we offer a wide variety of breeds and sizes, including small dogs. Some of the breeds we currently have are available golden retrievers, Labrador retrievers, French bulldogs, and more. And this one is the second one, the third one, the fourth one, and the fifth one. And most likely, many of these answers might not be totally accurate for your business. So all you need to do is just edit the answers, and then you can add it to your Google business profile. Okay, so let's go to the last local SEO prompt. So I'm gonna click on this templates button, and under the templates dropdown, I'm gonna click on generate Google business profile post from content, okay? Now this one is also one of my favorites because ChatGPT will generate a Google business profile post from whatever post content we add here, okay? So first, we need to choose from different languages. I'm gonna keep it as English, different voice tones, and also different writing styles you can choose from. And my business is going to be, again, pet store with puppies. And this is where we add our post content, okay? So you can add um, different search phrases, keywords. Maybe you published a blog article and you want a post to be generated from that blog article. You can post it here as well. But for this example, I'm going to post a question. So my content is, where can I find the top locations to get a veterinary diet that supports kidney health for my dog, okay? And this is our prompt template. And now I'm gonna click on execute template. Okay, so within a few seconds, ChatGPT generated an entire post for us. So this is the post content. And it starts off by saying, are you searching for a veterinary diet that supports kidney health for your furry friend? And it continues with another handful of paragraphs right here. And it also provided us with a call to action, okay? So we can copy and paste that as well into our post. It says, visit our store today and let us help you find the perfect veterinary diet for your furry friend, okay? So you can copy and paste this, publish it, and you are all set. Now, I also wanted to touch on this continue button on the top right-hand corner. Now, if we hover over this, Keywords Everywhere provided us with a list of actions that we can select to tell ChatGPT to do additional things after it generated a response. Okay, so we can tell ChatGPT to please continue where it left off. We can tell ChatGPT to clarify the response, to exemplify it, expand it, explain it, rewrite it, shorten it, or even tweetify it. So let's just say we think that maybe this post is a little too long for us. So what we can do is click on shorten and ChatGPT will shorten 
this post, okay? So it turned it into just a single paragraph. And it also provided us with the call to action as well. So this is a very powerful tool that you can use to tell ChatGPT to do additional things after it generated the first response for you. Okay, so those are all of the local SEO prompts I wanted to show you today. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe to our channel. And if you wanna check out our other videos, feel free to click any of the ones on the screen. Thank you so much for watching and we will see you in the next one.